Welcome everyone, this is Alex for the Coast Star and today we're doing a little construction update and some speculation on what Hershey Park is doing for next year. Is it a coaster? Is it a fly ride? I don't know, but it's a big area. So let's go talk about it. And here's a look from across the creek, Spring Creek that is. There is a bunch of trees gone from just two weeks ago. If you check out our park update that we just posted a few days ago, you can see that it's cleared out a lot more, especially below the overlook. Of course, we're gonna go and check it out from the overlook area, but whatever this is, this is exciting. Also looks like they're starting to clear a bunch of trees and bushes below the stadium. So this project looks like it might be bigger than we'd expect. And this is making you believe that it might be more than just a flat road. Here's a closer look, you can see they got plenty of crews on site. And they are definitely digging and hammering into a rock. So they are modifying the landscape as well to accommodate whatever is being built. Interested to see the theater is still there. I'm curious to see if it's integrated into whatever they're doing. Either it could be used for mechanical or a queue or something like that. Hopefully that gray wall that's very ugly from the view that you see from Overlook is removed. I believe it was put there as like a sound wall at some point. But the cedar was disused pretty quickly or reduced a lot of use a very long time ago because Great Bear was impacting shows significantly with its roar every time it went around. But this is very exciting to see. I thought it was cut and dry that it was going to be a flat ride, but now I'm really thinking it could be more. I honestly would love it if it went over the midway. I'd be like, I'd love it if they demolished the Dolphin Stadium. Definitely could not get these clear views of Great Bear a year ago. You could see a lot of it, but you couldn't see this clearly. This is pretty nice. I don't think you've ever been able to get these through the distance of its lifespan. So that's that's pretty neat to see. Let's take a look down here. These walls are typically used for reinforcing holes or whatnot, whether it be for building a foundation or holding back a hill. There's two possibilities. So, as are those down there. You can see some footers left over, I believe, from either a lamppost or whatever. It had to do with the old stadium down there. And the construction fence goes all the way to Coal Cracker, basically. Right now, you, they don't even have it so you can walk around this planter. You have to walk over this planter, which is kind of cool to see, actually. Oh, and provides you a nice little view here, too. There it is. So, very interesting. And, of course, this teaser has been up since opening day. So, the teaser is, don't mind, we're twisting up something. Hopefully, something special. I mean, that could be roller coaster. That could be flat ride. It's a very interesting construction site, one that is not easy to work on, one that doesn't typically lend itself to an off-the-shelf ride as well. And the more and more that gets cleared, as I said, my opinions on what this could be has changed since two weeks ago. Also, if you're at the park, just be aware if you want to go up to Kissing Tower Hill that you need to go from the Trailblazer area or from where you get the amazing milkshakes. Here's the other side there. Not much more. The midway is demolished a little bit down there. Very much demolished over there. They've taken a good chunk of it and dug down a bunch. And it looks like there is a footer over there. And there's our first footer. Thank you. 
Okay, I'm gonna say it once, I'm gonna say it like again. It's just very curious that this has all happened. Because before it being pretty cut and dry that it was gonna be a flat ride on top of the hill, but this confuses me very much so that they have started demolishing down here. And, you know, as I said, that old Dolphin Stadium that is kind of outdated and not with the times anymore. They got rid of that. Hmm. Could do something pretty cool. But, so we now have a footer starting and uh, lots of construction. So, but I don't think you can even go over that bridge over there. So yeah, all this is cut off now, access wise. So it's a, it could turn out to be a very big construction site. It better be something big because if you're closing that pathway mid-summer for something for next year, yeah, the cost of the reconstruction of the land probably costs more than the light itself. I don't know. This is very cool though. Now, from five regions of North America, the Zoo 